Hey, good morning, everyone. My name is Nate. This is Good Morning Liberty. I'm sorry for being a little bit late today. Uh, I just thought maybe I'd try out a different time. We'll see how it goes. Today, I'm going to talk about having principles because it's Friday, and I wanted to leave you with something to think about over the weekend that wasn't just real terribly awful, like most of the things I seem to talk about. Um, so let's talk about this thing of having principles. I titled the video Republican or Democrat, uh, or maybe just try having some principles. You know, Charlie just did a really good video. I recommend you go past this one and go watch Charlie's video on how the Republican Party actually just blocked an amendment to defund Planned Parenthood. And uh, the amendment was put up by Rand Paul, and uh, we, you know, always been a big supporter of his. But you know, Republicans talk all the time about how they want to get rid of Planned Parenthood. This was a big thing they campaigned on, and then you get Rand Paul, someone who actually ran for president, who went up there and put up an amendment uh, to do it. And of course, no one does anything. But aside from the actual people in Congress not doing anything. What I haven't liked is the lack of outrage from anyone in the Republican Party. There's been a little bit, you know, you get your Matt Walsh kind of people, you know, things like that, that are outraged, but not really as much as they would be if, you know, if there was a Democrat doing something to, you know, raise funding for Planned Parenthood or something like that. Then people would be outraged. And what it gets me thinking about is, just this, the pure simple fact that people just do things based on their party these days. What name do they have next to their, next to their name? Does it say Republican? Does it say Democrat? You know, I think that that's one of the, the big major issues that we have going on right now. Um, you know, Republicans don't always do everything right. Sometimes Republicans do things that are wrong. They do things that hurt people. Democrats don't always do things that are right. Sometimes they do things that are wrong and that hurt people. Sometimes Democrats do things that are good. And sometimes Republicans do things that are good. It all comes down to what your principles are. See, I have a really simple principle that says, you know, like, we'll take one, for example, taxation is theft. Why do I think taxation is theft? It's because I think that when you own something, that someone can't just take it from you without your permission. You know, I, uh, I trade my time in for money that someone thought that my time and my productivity was worth. You know, this is for people who work at a business somewhere. That's what you're doing. You're trading your time as, as a value that comes back to you in money. And one person can't just come to your house and take that from you. That would be stealing. If you came home with the money you made from work and put it on the table and someone broke in your house and took it, well, that's stealing, isn't it? That's not good. Now, if everyone on your street got together and walked into your house and said, we need to take some of your money, uh, still, still bad. If everyone in your entire neighborhood got together and came to your house to take your money, still bad. <clears throat> if everyone in the country groups together and appoints one person to run the whole thing, apparently that person can steal your money if they want to. Guys, principles are the same no matter what's going on, no matter what you want to use my money for. I don't care. It's mine. You know, it's mine. That's my principle. So don't steal from people. That's a really simple principle to have. Property ownership. That's a really simple principle to have. When you attack everything, based on your principles, your beliefs, then it's really easy to look at things that are going on politically and things that are going on in society and not come at it from some kind of biased political standpoint. You come at it from a nice, simple, principled standpoint. And it actually gives you an immediate answer to any situation that you see. See my whole taxation and theft principle? Well, I see a new government agency proposed, something like that. I can't get behind it. I can't. Are you going to use stolen money to fund it? I can't get behind it. I'm not, I don't care what you said it's going to do. I don't care what you said it's going to do. Are you going to use stolen money to do it? Can't get behind it. See? I just use a principle. 
I don't know what political party put up the idea. I don't care. I just use the principle that I had. And that's something that people need to do. Maybe it's not with taxation. Maybe that's not your thing. Maybe you think some taxation is okay. That's fine. Find your other principles. You know, Republicans, you uh, wanted Planned Parenthood to be defunded because you think that abortion is terrible. There's a principle right there. Don't kill unborn babies. Principle. Why aren't the Republicans doing anything about it? They don't have any principles. And if you don't show outrage about the things that the Republican Party does that are against your principles, then you don't have any principles. You don't. You just care about political parties. That's it. If you only show outrage when Democrats do something and show no outrage when Republicans do something, you're not a principled person. You're a partisan hack, as they would say. Don't be a partisan hack. That's not good. Because then we just end up blindly following whoever, whatever name someone has next to their name, all the way down to who knows where. So know your principles. Think about them this weekend. Think about what you believe in this weekend. You know, just think about it. What are your principles when it comes to abortion? What are your principles when it comes to theft? What are your principles when it comes to the rights of workers or the rights of business owners? You know, business owners are human beings. Do they have rights? You know, what are your principles? When you know what your principles are, you don't care what party puts up whatever idea it is. It's not about the party. It's about what you believe is right. And that's how I think we should all operate. Guys, that's all I'm going to do today. I got to get into the stock market real quick. Got to do some studying. So uh, I'll see you guys on Monday. Share the show. Go watch Charlie's video. He covered the Rand Paul and Planned Parenthood thing more than I just did. So go check that out. And uh, I'm going to see you guys on Monday. So thanks for watching. Later.